वेलकम बैक गाइज एंड गर्ल्स टू योर एट एच टी एम एल फाइव इन लाइन एस वी जी टूटोरियल विच इज अ पार्ट ऑफ आई फेक्शनर डॉट कॉम एच टी एम एल फाइव एन सी एस एस थ्री टूटोरियल सीरीज इफ यू वुड लाइक टू डाउनलोड द कोड फॉर दिस टूटोरियल एंड अदर टूटोरियल देन प्लीज विजिट आई फेक्शनर डॉट कॉम इन दिस टूटोरियल वी विल लर्न हाउ टू draw a polygon with the help of html5 inline svg tag to do that i open my file in notepad++ which is uh, and which is now growing and uh, before the ending svg tag i put i and put couple of enters and now i say that i want to draw a polygon a polygon is a shape uh, which has got different uh, you can say corners and i give an id to my polygon and i call it as my poly and to uh, now i need to define the points of my polygon so i say that i need to draw a polygon with the points now i need to tell the x1 y1 x2 y2 and let's say x3 y3 position of my polygon so i say that my polygon should start from here go here and it should end over here so it should be something like a triangle so i say that it should start at on x axis let's say 250 pixels and on y axis let's say 300 pixels so first position should be 250 and 300 pixels and the x to y to position should be i say that it should uh, go over here so x to position would be 200 and y to position would be x to position would increase and y to position would decrease so x to position should be 200 and y to position should be 375 and then it should go down and uh, the x to position should remain same and the y to position should increase so i say the y2 x2 should be 200 and y2 y3 should be 400 and after giving those points i say that i would like to fill my polygon with pink color and i end my tags i once check if it's okay i click on the save button and i can click on run launch in chrome command and now you see that we have got a very small polygon so i would change its x and y positions and i would change its color so we can easily see it i say that the polygon should start at 200 pixels on the x axis and on the y axis it should also start at 200 pixels I click on the save button and I click on the refresh button and now there is some problem because my polygon has got the same x1 and x2 positions so I say that it should be 250 and the x3 position should be 300 not 300 but let's say 150 I click on the save button go to my svg working area click on the refresh button and now see that we have drawn a polygon and we can change its values let's say i say that on the y x3 position should be 175 i click on the save button go to my page click on reload this page button and now see that my polygon has been changed 
Now I would like to add another corner to my polygon uh, and how can I do that? I will just add the X4 and Y4 position. I say that, that X4 should be 150 and Y4 should be 240. I click on the save button. I go to my browser window, click on the reload this page button and now see that our fourth dimension or the fourth corner has been added to our polygon and you can add an other position x5 and y5 position and I say that the x5 and the y5 position should be 120 and 200. I click on the save button. I go to my window, click on reload this, but this page button and now we have an other dimension added to our polygon. Another corner added to our polygon. So this is how you can experiment with the polygon tag and you can draw the polygon on your SVG working area. You can similarly add the stroke color and the stroke uh, uh, width. I would just copy uh, the code for the style and uh, now I click on the save button, go to my browser window, click on reload this page button and now there is a problem and what is the problem? Yeah, I haven't uh, copied the double quote in the end. I click on the save button, reload my page and now see we have added a border to our polygon and this is how you can experiment with the polygon uh, uh, in SVG and uh, in the next tutorial we will draw a polyline uh, on our SVG working area so please join me in the next iFactional.com video tutorial until then take care bye bye